Hello and welcome to today's video, where we'll be discussing Onan transformers. A Onan transformer is a type of transformer used in electrical power distribution systems. It stands for Oil Natural Air Natural, which we'll discuss in more detail later in the video. So, let's get started. What is a transformer? First, let's briefly talk about what a transformer is. A transformer is an electrical device that transfers energy between two or more circuits through electromagnetic induction. In simpler terms, it changes the voltage and current levels of an electrical signal. What is an Onan transformer? An Onan transformer is a type of transformer that uses oil as a cooling agent and air as an insulating agent. The transformer is designed to allow natural circulation of oil and air, hence the name Oil Natural Air Natural. How does an Onan transformer work? The core of an Onan transformer is immersed in oil, which acts as a coolant for the transformer. The windings are also immersed in the oil and are connected to high voltage and low voltage circuits. When electrical energy is supplied to the transformer, it induces an electromagnetic field in the core, which causes voltage and current to be transferred from the high voltage to the low voltage circuit. How does an Onan transformer cooling system work? An Onan transformer uses oil as a cooling agent and air as an insulating agent. The transformer is designed to allow natural circulation of oil and air to cool the transformer. Let's start with the oil cooling system. The core and windings of the transformer are immersed in oil, which acts as a coolant for the transformer. As the transformer operates, Heat is generated due to the resistance of the windings and core to the flow of electrical current. The oil absorbs this heat and carries it away from the transformer, effectively cooling it down. The oil flows through a series of cooling fins or radiators attached to the transformer tank. These radiators are designed to dissipate heat from the oil into the surrounding air. The air flow through the radiators is natural, which means that there are no additional fans or pumps required to move the air. The heat from the oil is transferred to the air by convection, which is the transfer of heat by the movement of fluids. The heated air rises naturally, and cooler air from the surroundings replaces it to maintain the natural air flow. The insulating properties of the air are also important for the transformer's cooling system. As the transformer operates, the windings and core can become charged with electrical energy. The air surrounding the transformer helps to insulate it from the environment and prevents electrical discharges or arcing between the windings and the transformer tank. In summary, the Onan transformer cooling system uses oil as a coolant and air as an insulator. The transformer is designed to allow natural circulation of oil and air, which cools and insulates the transformer during operation. The oil flows through cooling fins or radiators, and the air flow is natural with no additional fans or pumps required. The insulating properties of the air surrounding the transformer help to prevent electrical discharges or arcing. Advantages of an Onan Transformer One of the advantages of an Onan Transformer is that it is cost-effective, as it uses natural cooling and insulation methods instead of requiring additional cooling and insulation systems. It also has a lower risk of fire, as the oil acts as a fire retardant and helps to dissipate heat. Disadvantages of an Onan Transformer One of the disadvantages of an Onan Transformer is that it is not as efficient as other types of transformers. The natural cooling and insulation methods used can limit the amount of energy that can be transferred through the transformer. Additionally, the oil can degrade over time, which can lead to decreased performance or even failure of the transformer. So, that's a brief overview of Onan transformers. They're an important part of electrical power distribution systems and can provide a cost-effective and safe way to transfer energy. However, it's important to keep in mind their limitations and to properly maintain them to ensure their longevity and reliability. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. Join the Electricity Frenzy community and subscribe to our channel today.